These are all the collectibles in Chapter 4. The first one is going to be a log called Bridge Attack. This is going to be in the main atrium. As you enter it, you're going to see a breach in the hall, and you're going to find the collectible sitting down some stairs on the right-hand side of this room. This is kind of like the, the hub of the entire area. We'll pass through here a few times. There's the breach, and just to the right, down the stairs, is going to be the log. Now, we're going to continue from here and then follow the main objective into the captain's nest. Inside the captain's nest is going to be a log called Eckhart's Clearance. It's going to be just inside to the right. You'll be sitting outside the nest there for a moment, talking with your partner there, and then after a moment, you'll be able to come in here. Now, there's a few things we're going to do in here. We're going to get that first log, and we're going to get more time as a log that's just to the left of it. Make sure you interact with that. And to the left of this is a console that you need to interact with. This is part of the second side mission. So just interact with that. And then we're going to head back out to the atrium area. And we're going to go through this door in front of us, which you need security clearance two for, which you, as part of the story, would have just gotten. So as you're trying to leave, well, you can't. A brute is going to come out. Now, for this log, all you need to do is not shoot it. Just run. If you shoot him, you're going to miss the, the uh, log. So you're going to just sit here and wait until your partner gets on the comms and says, shoot it in the back. Of course, the name of this collectible. If you did shoot it, you're not going to be able to get it. You can return a new game plus, or because you only need 150 of the logs, so there's a few you can leave, and this would be one. All right, so after you get that uh, comms check, you can go ahead and kill the brute and loot him for a node. Now, we're going to enter the room from where the brute just came. We're going to go through here, the security room, turn right at the very end in the back room, is another log on the ground right next to the bench okay so now we're going to go into the elevator so we're going to go ahead and access the elevator control and we're going to go into the elevator here and we're going to take this to the second floor and we're going to go inside the storage room so we're going to go out through this next door and we're going to have a, a hallway here and it's going to have a vacuum of space problem but we're going to ignore it because we have a nice suit and go through the door right in front of us inside of here to the left is going to be a node and then we're going to leave this room and go just down the hall for a weapon called the contact beam so as i mentioned we're going to go from this spot we're going to go down the hall, through the door, and into this room here to the right. Not before I get my credits, of course. As soon as we go through here, door just to our right. And it'll be on the ground right in front of you. Now, once you have this picked up, we're going to leave this room and go in the room across the hall. And this is going to be a, uh, a fairly large size room. Here's called Mining Administration. Now, we're going to go through a door to the right, but we can't go through it yet. We have to blow a fuse before it'll open. So to do that, we're going to go in the room to the left first, and you'll see the fuse on the left-hand side. There's other stuff to loot in here, of course. To get to this collectible, log number six called Tracking Infection, you have to break that fuse and then you can go into this door here that'll be unlocked for you now. Go through yet another door and we're going to find the log in there. We'll also get a node in the same room. It'll be on the wall just to your right. All right, since we're in the mining administration area, it's time to talk about uh, a missable story-related log because there are three areas, three rooms where you need to reroute power, this being one of the three. And for the first two that you do, you're going to get an audio log, but you're not gonna be able to get the third one. And all three of them have an audio log. So in order to get the third one, you're gonna have to do New Game Plus and do that room first. So it's only the first two rooms that you do where you're going to get the story-related audio log. Just wanted to mention that here real quickly. 
So now we're going to get the believers log as well as the um, unitology article. There's two logs in one room. So we're going to go back to the elevator. If you're following the blue waypoint marker, you're going to be taken right in here. Go to floor three, and then we're going to go through this door, follow the hall to the break room. The break room is going to be here just to the right. Two collectibles, one audio log as soon as you enter the room automatically here, and then a second one for picking up this one here on the bench. Now, after you've gotten those two, we're going to leave the room, and there's going to be a room in the center of this area. You're going to see it's going to have a locked door. Now, in order to open this, we're going to have to shoot the fuse. In order to shoot the fuse, we're going to come back around here and move these boxes using Kinesis. There's some boxes on the, against the door there. Move them out of the way, and you can see the fuse. Shoot that. So inside the room, you're going to get a weapon upgrade for the pulse rifle, the PCSI custom magazine. Okay, so you're going to leave this room and go through the next door. It's going to be the electrical systems. For this area, just go all the way to the back side of this, and you're going to see a brute. Kill the brute, and you're going to get another node dropped from its body. Now, just past the brute is going to be another room where you have to reroute the power. We just did it in the administration. We're going to do it here as well. This will be the second one we do. So we're going to get another audio log when you complete that task. And that task is going to be done in the room back here. You can see like a tentacle thing back there as well. But you kill, kill the brute to get the node. And then you can... Go ahead and reroute the power here. If you reroute the power here and in the other one, you're not going to be able to get the one later. And I'll show you once we get to that point in the purification area. That room there with the, the, the cables going haywire. All right, so now we're heading back to the atrium and we are now looking for Elizabeth. That is the name of log number nine. We are going to go into the purification area here, the water purification. Now, so at this point, that if you go back to the store, there's going to be another weapon upgrade. I'm not mentioning the upgrades from the shop, so make sure you're checking the shop regularly for the upgrade. A new one for the contact beam has just been added after our previous task. All right, looking for Elizabeth here. We're on the second elevator in the atrium. On the first floor there is going to be of uh, the audio log. Now we're going to go through the hallway and we're going to pass the water purification area where you rerouted power. Again, when you reroute power, you only get it in the first two. So if you want the log for rerouting power here, do New Game Plus and go there first before the other two. So through this door to the right, got the Eva prep room. We're going to walk inside of there, go straight and find the, the schematic. Okay, so we are leaving this room, going through the next door. We're just, again, following the path. And another elevator. You're going to get an, uh, a log as soon as you come up the elevator, and you can get a second one right from this machine with the envelope next to the save point. So you're going to be actually doubling up on audio logs at the same time. And then, finally, we have a quest item. This is White Rig. So continue outside. And this is the area where you're going to have to line up these turrets. And you're going to calibrate them. After the final one, it's going to be on the left-hand side. Keep going past it. Keep flying past it, and you'll see the little blue or the purple glow. That is the quest item for side mission two. You are not authorized. They're back. The ADS cannons are online shipwide. Thank God. Now, because you couldn't get all of the audio logs, the story-related ones, if you check your tracker, you're going to have one missing. It's going to be, say not found. It made me panic for a moment, but don't worry. You're okay. Uh, if you're a trophy hunter, you don't even have to come back and get it. If you're a completionist, you may want to. Uh, so go ahead. Click on Chapter 5. If you guys want to move on, thank you for watching. Please hit that like button and subscribe.